Hey guys, <clears throat> that last video was so hard to upload, I promise you. <laughs> guys, this is the air, um, not the air, oh my goodness. This is um, Fire Signs, Aries, Sagittarius, and Leo. I'm going to tell you, I'm, I am telling, wipe me down. <laughs> I can't, I can't put like, what's that song? Oh, wipe me down. I'm hearing wipe me down. I have not, what the hell? I'm on wipe me down. Guys, what in the world am I channel? Oh my goodness. I'm on wipe me down. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, I cannot curse because I'm trying to get if I curse guys ain't YouTube ain't gonna pay me. Lord Jesus, I just found it out. Okay, I gotta watch my mouth. Okay. <laughs> but I'm here, seriously. I'm on wipe me down. Okay, so I'm assuming someone is very happy. Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. Guys, <laughs> the shit I hear in my head, man. I can't. Look at this one flew out. I'm going to go ahead and take it. The sun. Thank you guys for my new cards. You guys have really been donating to Empress Shay Shay. I really appreciate it. This is These are the create the beautiful creator tarot cards. I love these tarot cards. I promise you. I've never seen such beautiful cards. Okay, this flew out, so I'm going to take it. Okay, the sun is a very beautiful card. It's a very, it's a major arcana, meaning it's happening now. It's the sun. It's clarity. You've been, your eyes have been open to something. You're very happy. Look at how she's playing this guitar, guys. You're very happy about something. Someone makes you feel really good about yourself or really good about something. Guys, it's either, it's either you or your person, okay? This is a very general message. Take it how it resonates, okay? Let's see. Oh, my goodness. This is funny. I'm on wipe me down. I cannot play with y'all tonight. Oh, my goodness. Guys, I am doing a lot. <laughs> Believe me, I am doing a lot. Tonight is my little sister's birthday, and she went clock struck 12. She wanted me to stay with her, but I couldn't because I got uh, so many readings. And Oh, my goodness. <clears throat> oh goodness, this is too much. I'm on <laughs> yeah. what the fuck? Oh goodness. Guys, I go walking. I do my my daughter bought me an exercising bike for Christmas. I do that like an hour a day. I'm on wipe me down. <laughs> I'm back to doing my five miles, and then I do my hour a day on this damn bike, man. I'm telling you. Hold up. Somebody don't want me to. Come on, Divine. Holy Spirit, show me. There we go. Okay. The Hermit. Someone has went within. And just like I said, when they went within, that is Virgo energy. You're dealing with a Virgo. They've been illuminated of something. They see something clear. They see something perfectly clear, sweetheart. What else, Holy Spirit? It's not going to be a long reading, guys. It's my last of the, of, the, of the signs. Oh, goodness. This is too funny. They're really happy. That's why I hear wipe me down. I'm on. <laughs> Fire signs. This is I love this reading though because I feel the energy of being very happy. Okay. I don't want no sad reading. Okay, no love. Seven of Pentacles. Progress. Uh either you or your person see progress in this situation, okay? They see that they can build with you, that you're something. Um what I want to say. I was gonna say adventurous. But they see progress here. They see that they're actually getting somewhere with you now because they had clarity. That's earth energy. Um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I think we're in a blue moon tonight, guys, if I'm not mistaken. Guys, we're going to have a hell of a birthday for Emperor Shay Shay. My birthday, February. We're going to party all night long. Party till it's 1999, like friends say. Okay. We had a six of swords. Detachment. This person either felt like he was detaching from them 
or they had to detach to really go within to get clarity. Take it how it resonates. This person is the king of wands. They like your sex. They like to have sex with you. They have already made their decision, judgment. They the knight of wands, that little playboy. They playboy. I'm going to tell you, when you have the... When you have... What have I just seen? Okay, Holy Spirit, show it to me. When you have the king of wands and the knight of wands, you got yourself a playboy. Straight hope. That's real talk. But I like the knight of wands because... And I say this all the time because it's a fun energy, guys. This person... Don't lead you to believe it's nothing different. They let you know, hey, I'm I'm in the world. You know, um, it is what it is. So you know this person is is a fun loving person, but this person's in for a good time, not a long time. But this person's very grounded. This person's still very grounded, and they still observing everything. Okay, this is all Earth energy on here. Queen of Cups, intuition. Okay. They dealing with a Cancer Pisces Scorpio, but they have regret from dealing with this Cancer Pisces Scorpio. It's something about this Cancer Pisces Scorpio that's dark, and they regret dealing with this person, and they regret coming in and out with you and being real quick with you. They regret the things that they did with you in the past for this Queen of Cups, this Cancer Pisces Scorpio. This person is like not right. This energy of this Queen of Cups is not right. This is a water sign. They're dealing with a water sign. Or either you're a water sign. Or maybe you're dealing with a water sign. Okay, what else, Holy Spirit? It could be a fire sign that's dealing with a water sign. Or maybe a fire sign have water in their chart. You guys, take it how it resonates. I don't really like to do signs because signs really don't matter. Take the message how it resonates with you. Guys, take advantage of my specials because my energy reads are $100. And um, I'm giving you guys a special tonight. Okay. Okay, come on. Look at this. Eight of Pentacles. Practice. Practice make perfect. That's what I'm hearing. Okay, this is another earth. You guys need to go back and look at my readings. You're dealing with an earth sign. This is Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I have a lot of earth energy out here. Okay, this person is missing you. This person is sad. And they said that they did not build with you the way they wanted to. That they didn't come to the plate the way they wanted to with you. Okay, but now they feel like you're worth I'm hearing potion and pills. So maybe they um they brought up a potion to come back towards you, a practice make perfect. Guys, you make sense of that. I'm not even gonna wreck my brain with that one. Okay. What else, Holy Spirit? Show me what else, Holy Spirit. Okay. Good Lord. Okay. Fire signs, four pentacles. Okay. This person feels like you're holding back from them. Okay, they feel like you're not talking. They don't understand why you're not talking. Okay, I already got the Eight of Pentacles. Queen of Cups. Okay, let's see. Five of Swords. They feel like you have your guard up. They feel like they can't say anything because you're mad at them. Four of Swords. Maybe you guys needed a break from each other. Four stores is rest. To me, what I get from four stores is rest and rejuvenation, repose. You have to bag up in order to get clarity. And see right here where it says that um, the clarity came through. So you guys had to like bag up, rest and rejuvenate, take a break from each other. Okay, that's what I'm getting. Two of Wands, confusion. Sometimes you make this person a bit confusion. Two of Swords, I mean. You are air sign. So you may be a little too free spirit for this earth sign. Okay? And they may not. Sometimes your actions may be a bit confusing to this person. So you have to be more clear with what you're doing. 
But the Three of Wands, they know that you're patient and you try to be so patient. But they're still watching you. Even though they're not in communication, they're still watching you. The Hierophant. This person is dealing with a lot. This person is dealing with a lot. Okay. I'm getting this on a one scenario. This person could be married. This person could be a spiritual teacher. Your belief systems may be different. That could be a factor. Okay. That is what I'm getting, guys. Okay. Here we go. Ooh, let's see. Intellect. Guys, I'm going to tell you something. Ace of Swords. This person see nothing but good in you. This person see nothing but good in you. New beginnings. You're very intellectual. They are a sapiosexual. They never thought they could be a sapiosexual. Okay? I'm hearing a sapiosexual is a person that looks at a person. They, they, they want a person sexually because of their intellect. They're very smart. And they never thought they can really look at a person for the intellectual, um, what do I want to say, for the intellectual um, sense of being. They thought they can always look at a person for the outer being or maybe they got a good heart or whatever. But, excuse me, to be with earth signs, some earth signs are very shallow. I'm just going to put it out there. I don't mean to knock your earth signs, but... They want what they want, and a lot of times they look at the outer being. So now they're saying, okay, they're sapiosexual. They're looking at, guys, I've never used that word before. The Holy Spirit is telling me and giving me the meaning. But the sapiosexual, they look at your intellect, and it's sexy to them. Your intellectual being is sexy to them. And they never thought they could look at a person that way. You make they penis hard by just the way you talk. <laughs> what the hell? Okay. All right. Watch your mouth, Empress Shay Shay. Okay. Transformation. Your person is going through a transformation, and that's why they can see all this clear. That's why they said clarity. They're going through a transformation, which is good. And whoever's going through the transformation, congratulations. Okay. Everybody is page of cups. Everybody's talking about you. Intervene. <laughs> Everybody is talking about you. Everybody's gossiping about you. Oh my God. <laughs> the magician. This person is manifesting you. King of cups. This person do, does have emotions for you. Knight of cups. You have the Knight of Cups and you have the King of Cups. You have two options, guys. Oh, my God. And the King of Pentacles. Okay, Fire Signs. What is going on, really? Okay, Fire Signs. You have three men. Oh, my goodness. You have a King of Cups, a Knight of Cups, and a King of Pentacles. You have an Earth Sign and two Water Signs that want you. So you have to make a choice. Either you or your person will have to make a choice. So take this shit as it resonates. It whatever's in the past, you were dealing with the earth sign in the past, but two water signs is coming towards you or either like you or that's in competition with this earth sign. What in the holy hell? I cannot. Come on, Holy Spirit. What else to close this reading? This is weird. So you have an earth sign that's getting clarity on who you are, but you have two water signs that's trying to be in competition with this earth sign. Okay. So you're going to have your um, pick of three men. You go, girl or boy. Knight of Swords. And this is why this person's mad. Because this person's upset. Because this person knows that you have a lot of options. And that's what's stopping them. And they're trying to be patient with the situation. Three of Cups. That's why they haven't offered you anything right now. They want to build with you and help you with your business. But they know you have a lot of options. Okay, the curiosity, they know you deal with the paranormal. Nine of Pentacles, they know you're very grounded, very stable. They know you're very beautiful, Queen of Wands. 
They know you're very passionate, very sexual.